Hey everybody, I'm Nine Truths Warning, meteorologist Brandon Spinner. We have turned the calendar to March. Now we're able to fully look at the month of February. And boy, what a month it was. It finished with a 42.4 degree average temperature. To put it in perspective, our usual average, 34.7. So that's 7.7 .7 degrees above where we should be, which puts it on the calendar and on the record book as the seventh warmest February ever recorded, dating back to 1873 here in Cincinnati and across the tri-state. What made it even even more abnormal is we didn't have any snow, like none, a trace of snowfall. That means that it was a dusting, if not less, at the airport. That's only happened four other times, 1918, 1932, 1949, and 1953, with places it solely at the top as the least snowy Februarys we've ever recorded. And that means we are several inches below normal here as we've gone through the winter. And it's been one of the warmest winters we've ever had as well, also finishing in the top 10 for the least amount of snow and the least amount of warmth, uh, excuse me, least amount of cold air with the top 10 warmest winters on record. Now we're into March. March starts on March 1st with a average temp of 48, but by the end of the month, we're looking at 60s as our average. We see usually about 3.4 inches of snow and don't forget this month, daylight saving time starts. That is March 12th of 2023. As far as the month of March, the outlook looking relatively average regarding the temperatures, but looks like we could have a wetter than normal month of March, which means we could have a lot of rainfall over the next several weeks. Thanks for watching. Thanks for clicking on WCPO.com. Hope you have a great rest of your day.